Alright guys, so I have a very decent PC, as you can see I have like barely have 40 or 50 FPS on this screen. So um, in order to get a better performance, I would so just go to options and over here the FPS you're gonna make it like 60 or 90 at most. So I'm just might make it uh, 90 and the quality The high right, high max. I guess high. But the rest of this make it medium. Because by default those are by default those are like max settings. So if you have a lower end GPU like me, you just wanna make sure those are medium. And apply changes. Game for controls. So that's basically all you have to do in game. Uh, yeah. Let's go, to, go back, and I can see it's much more smoother, a little smoother I feel. And I'm just waiting until this performance bar is fully finished or not, so I'm just going to wait. As you can see, the game looks a little better than before. So I'm just going to tell you what my current GPU is. So I'm going to right click, go to Task Manager, and I'm going to go to Performance. And I'm gonna go to this is my current GPU, which is a very decent, very low budget mid range GPU, which is RTX 3060. So, um, yeah, just so let's, let's just wait till this finish, and I'm gonna show you the next step. What are you gonna need to do? So I have a couple of games, so like when you uh, click options and play like not full screen mode, and all of a sudden it gets so much better. Um, it's because you you have the full screen optimization, it's turned, turned off. So you need to turn that on uh, before you play the game. So that thing is good, so my game is it's gonna be pretty good, as you can see. It's pretty optimized, and I'm sure uh, it's just gonna go get in. So now we're gonna go to the Steam, go to the settings bar, and over here go to browse local files. So what it does is it's gonna take you to the local files, and you're gonna right click over here, go to properties, go to compatibility mode, and over here click disable full screen optimization. So what it does, I just told you a few seconds ago, it's just, you don't have to be disabled full screen in order to get a good performance. So you're going to click OK and restart the game. And it's going to look way much better. And my game is looks pretty decent, I'm not going to lie. It's very decent. So I'm just going to alter F4, and I'm going to go to the further steps. I'm going to go to NVIDIA control panel. If you don't have NVIDIA control panel, you need to change something else. I mean, you can uh, change some drivers or find a different way to go to the control panel. I come into the control panel here and make it large icons. So on here, make sure this PHYSX configuration is used to your GPU. So as you can see, this PHYSX is pointing out to my GPU, not my CPU. So this is very important. Make sure you, you don't use your CPU. Just use your GPU instead. It's also if you have like integrated graphics card also with your main card. So yeah. And, and there's a third one, which is go to your NVIDIA GeForce Experience or NVIDIA whatever and go to drivers 
and make sure you're using the latest version. So I am using the latest version, seems like, but tomorrow likely there will be a new version available because there it's this game is pretty big. So I'm sure there will be a new game and it will be added over here. So go to your home tab and if it's added go to click details and once you click details in here there is an optimize option. So you're gonna click the optimize. So it will give you the best performance for your computer. Yeah, you can just click optimize for this game. So this game just out, so it's not available yet, but it will be available soon. And the finally, make sure your computer is, is clean. You have enough memory, make sure no program is running in the background when you play the game. And also go to run. You're going to go to start menu and type run. And type what, I what I'm typing. You're going to type T-R-E-E. -E. So what it basically does is just uh, refresh your cache memory on your RAM. And then go to RAM again and delete some, some of the junk files which is make your computer a little bit faster. So these files are not, these files are pretty much junk. You're going to shift delete. And I have 243 junk files, which is very harmful. I mean, it's kind of useless. So just going to delete and skip it. Once you've done that, you're going to go to run again and type recent. You might think these files are useful because it looks real, but you can check the type of files is shortcut. So shortcut is, is technically useless. So you can control A, shift delete. And last but not least, go to the prefetch, T C H prefetch. Okay, if it's not opening for some reason, just delete whatever inside. So again, if this would help you, please subscribe. That will be much appreciated. See you guys on the next video. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.